Crave Brothers Farm near Waterloo, Wisconsin is a family enterprise focused on making themselves better for the future. And every decision counts. Patrick Crave says they rely on genomic data for insight into how to make genetic progress within the herd. They started using genomic testing on a select group of animals about a decade ago and expanded to testing all females in 2018. We make all of our breeding decisions based on based on the genomic information that we get. So um, it's able to allow me to more accurately determine which animals I want to get heifer calves out of and then utilize the rest of the herd for beef semen. By selectively breeding dairy heifers and breeding the balanced to beef bulls, Crave Brothers Farm has improved profitability, Crave says. They also have an outstanding cheese operation, which greatly influences breeding decisions. There's, there's a few traits that we really look at in terms of the cheese side of things. Um, the, the pounds of combined fat and protein, so just total solids that go into the milk, that go into making cheese. Um, the somatic cell for high quality milk to be made into cheese, and then the B kappa casein gene, uh, which helps with the coagulation of the milk, so you get more cheese per 100 pounds of milk. Being more selective in breeding decisions has yielded great results within the herd, Crave says. We've really noticed in our first lactation animals, uh, we've, we've cut an, a month and a half off of our age at first calving, and they're still peaking at right around the same or even higher than they were a few years ago. Getting females into the milking string even a month earlier has resulted in increased profitability. Each boost is further evidence Crave Brothers Farm will continue using genomic data. I think with the amount of data that you're getting and the amount of data that you can use to be profitable, I think more and more people are going to keep doing it. And if they're not, I feel like they're losing out. The next focus area for the family dairy is wellness traits, Crave says. He predicts the next five to ten years are going to be influenced by wellness traits. Maybe there's something else that we could be looking at in terms of wellness because that's that's really a key. Visit HolsteinUSA.com to learn more. For Holstein Association USA, I'm Miles Ramsey.